Chris, Marion County Clerk in Salem, Oregon. What's the biggest part of the process that you think people should know about? Without the signature matching, we cannot count your ballot. If you get past October 27th, don't mail it. Find an official Oregon drop site. This is one of the busiest weeks that your office will face. What does that mean for you this year and this big election? The registration over the last few days has caused us to send out more than 6,000 more ballots. Our voters are going to start receiving them Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. And that's over 200,000 ballots going out that way. We've already had over 600 ballots come back to us this election. Uh, Four years ago, the presidential election about this time, we had about 400 ballots. And people can track their ballots this year, too. Multnomah County and Yamhill County also have something called Track My Ballot. It's going to send you a text or an email or a phone message each stage of your ballot's progress. In fact, it'll even remind you at day seven, if you haven't returned a ballot yet, it'll also tell you if the ballot's been received, number one, which is important. You also want to get the message that says accepted. Accepted means that your signature has been approved, which means we can open the ballot envelope and count your ballot. What should people really expect when it comes to the timeline of counting these votes? You mentioned that sometimes there's delays when you've got to touch base with people who didn't do it the right way. No election administrator is calling the election on election day. Now, sometimes there are candidates that concede, candidates that declare victory, But those are just preliminary results. We don't certify the election for 20 days. The state has 10 more days to certify. Is there anything else that you think people should hear directly from election officials this year? And there are people out there inhibit people from voting or discourage people from voting. In Oregon, I want to let people know your vote does count. If you see any problem at a ballot drop site, call 911. Thank you so much for your time and sharing all of this with us. Well, thank you, Galen. It's been a pleasure talking with you. Let's do it again.